Hey guys, Majora's Mask Mailman here, and welcome back to part four, no, five, of oh, Let's Play Earthbound Zero. In the last part, we went to the zoo and got another melody, and now we, we are in a strange land. Um, if I haven't already said it, I'm just going to say it right now. You're a strange person. For some reason, I like you. Oh, I was thinking he was going to tell us. We're in Magic Ant. Um, I'm not going to say much more than that, but yeah, this is kind of a weird land. Seashell houses. And weird people who wear witch hats. I'm the mysterious goods keeper. You have a need? Yes. I'm gonna leave Great Grandfather's diary because I don't think we need that anymore. Because we needed it to get in, but um, I don't think we need it for the rest of the game, if I'm remembering correctly. But let's check in here. Um, this. Mysterious Mimicker transfers four hundred ninety-six dollars into your account. Basically, it's the same as calling your dad. So, um, yeah, two thirty-six. Uh, sure, I'll save. Yeah, blah blah blah. Continue. It even says the slam. They probably just copy and paste it in the script. Script. Would you like me to give you the big bag? Yeah. Can I borrow your cash card for a while? Sure. Thank you. Sure, sure. I'll return it to you. I thought that it looked pretty cool. Um, what you're gonna want to do? Oh wait, never mind. Um, make sure you have two inventory slots open. Obviously, since he just took your cash card, he's you're gonna have one, but you're gonna need another one. That's right. I have to return your cash card. I give you the big bag, a gift for you. So what the big bag does is you use it and um, you will take out a magic herb, like, I thought we got a magic, oh, that's right, I loaded a different save state, that's right, but anyway, you'll take out a magic herb and um, it'll heal for about 30 HP, like I said, and it's a multi-use item and it should last you for most of the game. Uh, for the past two playthroughs, it did, just because I, I usually didn't use it, and it's probably a good idea to use it more than I did. Um, yeah, so let's go in here first, I think that's where I want to go. Yeah. The Ocarina of Hope is finally completed. This melody can now flow out from it. Do you want it? Uh, sure. You're a pretty straight-looking dude, go ahead. Ah, you can't carry it, what a shame. I'll eat a hamburger. Yeah, I, I realized that I, uh, had no inventory space when I talked to him, but, oh well. Ocarina of Home, blah, blah, blah. You want it? Nope. It's quite obvious that you want it, ha, ha, Go on, take it. Yeah, so, basically, if you have an inventory slot open and you talk to him, you're getting the Ocarina. Um, and I'll show you what it does in a sec. I bet my spoon is hard to use like this. Do you think so you could somehow fix it for me? Yeah, okay. Please fix it right away. And I fixed it with PSI power. Thanks a million, munch munch. Hey, would you like to spend the night here? Okay, that's good. So this is a healing place, even though there's already another one here. Please come again. Promise me you'll come again. So yeah, I, I because he's an idiot, he bent a spoon. I don't... Why would you bend a spoon? That's stupid. But we also have a healer here. He will also heal status ailments. So, um, he, in some respects, he's better than this guy over here, but, um, this healer, when you have more party members, can only heal one person at a time, so it takes a little bit longer. Okay, these shells that have the sevens on them are all shops. You're going to want to buy one thing from each shop. What are you staring at? You're in magic hand, it's just like the world outside. Just leave me some cash when the goods you can dash. Hee hee hee. You're gonna want the magic coin. Don't bother buying a magic herb, we have a big bag. And they all say the same thing. The gold ring. And... What are you staring at? You magic is just like the world outside. Just shut up. <sighs> and the H2O pendant. 
Um, I guess with the pendants, it's really your call, but, um, you know, with H2O pendant, it makes fired enemies do less damage, and I think this is the most useful, because I think there are most fire enemies in this game, more than, I guess, fire would protect against ice and earth against electricity, and, um, also fire attacks are multi-targeting, so I always just go with all H2O pendants, and repel ring... You can, it's in that same slot as the pendant. You can use it, but it just lowers the encounter rate. But you have to do a lot of grinding in this game, so I wouldn't even bother just because you're gonna get less level ups. And a magic snail. These guys have pretty high defense, and they'll sometimes attack in pairs. And I'm just gonna run from this guy. Ugh, have the hiccups. Uh, dude. Come on, I wanna run away. Oh, come on. We're actually going to be getting another, um, weapon here soon, so that's nice. Oh, if you see this red weed here, um, you can, I just check it, I guess, and you'll get red weed in your inventory. Um, no dirty thoughts, please, but, um, dude. Okay, watch it. These guys are pretty simple. Basically, just attack them. There's not anything special about them. Yeah, blah, blah. You're boring, watch it. And you just gotta smash your attack. You're a jerk. Oh. And there we go. We healed him. Now let's take out our handy dandy big bag and use it. <coughs> Um, so yeah, Magic Hand is a very good place to grind because there are many healing spots and also just a ton of enemies you can fight, so I recommend grinding here. And touching the fountain, your uh, HP is refilled, but not PP. And if you use telepathy on the fountain here, you soulful cry, the benevolent old man showed up, he acts as the ATM. You should call me up? Yes. You need money, don't you? <sighs> Yes. I, I, he's just like, need money, don't you? He's like, well, it's fine. It seems kind of insulting. But, um, I... I don't know. Since I'm just going to load the next save state where I've done the grinding and got on all the equips, I don't really want to, uh, go buy the equips. And I've already shown what equips you should get so uh oh dude i went way too high wow dude, good job avoiding random encounters so basically to get here just it's right from the village just go ah just go straight up okay groucho these enemies are somewhat special in that they're weak enemies, and if you kill them, they'll give you three experience, but just guard when you fight them. Trust me. And yeah, they're weak, it's annoying. Just wait. You will see. See, there we go. Groucho said hello and then walked away. And your XP will increase far more than if you had killed them. So that's nice. And let's talk to you. So I want to get past. Suspicious man, I'll let you pass. Solve the riddle. Well, what's the riddle? Well, let's just read his mind and figure out the answer. That's right, the answer is two alligators. Although I haven't come up with the riddle yet. Um, what happens when you have three alligators, but one gets shot in the head with a harpoon? How many alligators do you have left? Two alligators. Oh! Okay, I'm sorry. Um, I believe we want to go this way, but you can get an item in here. Uh, which... is it this one? Yeah. Um... Boomerang. Okay. Actually, that's a pretty good way to check. <coughs> oh. Excuse me. PSI stone. We can check... Every item in here. Fight capsule... VSI Stone is a multi-use item that lets you restore PP. Fight Capsule, basically you drink it and your fight will go up. Berry Tofu, I believe, heals you? I think. 
Let's see. Ruler. I don't even know what that does. I don't know if it serves a purpose. And rope. Basically, you tie the enemy up. We already have rope, don't we? Yeah, rope. Go away. Oh, don't talk, dude. Check. And we got the boomerang. And when you do that, all the presents will be open, so you can only get one thing, and I highly recommend you get the boomerang, because it's basically... The boomerang is going to be your weapon for Nintendo for the rest of the game until we get his ultimate equip in the final area of the game. What's in here? I, I really don't care. Magic herb... What? Oh, crud. I don't... What is here? Empty. Oh, uh, they're all empty, aren't they? Bullhorn. Um, I don't know what that does, but the hippie enemy has a bullhorn, and it's and he yells like, "Your mother's calling for you," and it'll either say, "Nintent believed it, and its fight decreased by whatever," or, "But Nintent didn't believe it." Uh, Nintent flew into a rage, and his offense increased by twenty or something like that. So, um, yeah. So I'm guessing it does that. Uh, flash dark, like a flashlight, flash dark, uh, get it? But, um, but anyway, um, it just blinds enemies, lowers accuracy. So, yeah. Hey, red carpet, cool. Welcome, Ninten. Here in Magic Hand, everyone is your friend. You can have as much as you like, of whatever you want. What? You want to listen to my song? Sorry, I don't know why, but I just can't sing. I think you learn the melody. It's only eight notes long. It's pretty short. When you learn them all, return and sing them for me. If only I could hear that song. Oh, so that must be the melodies that we've been learning. But there's more than eight notes. It's just like eight sections of the melody. Well, let's play the ocarina for. So yeah, it'll play whatever melodies we have, and you have to come back here um, at the end of the game once you've collected all the melodies to play it for. And now I'm going to sing the lyrics that go with this. Take a melody, simple as can be, give it some words and... So yeah, it goes on, and that's all we have. So, I'm not the best singer, but... Hey, at least I'm better than Shugga Conroy! I'm sorry. Um, anyway... Oh, wait, it's not here. Hey, let me pass. See you later. Okay, thank you. So, if we come over here... I wonder if there are any random encounters when you're hugging these pillars. Um, let's see, it's some- here it is. There's this house. Go in. And you have all these guys, the air flying men. I'm the flying man, my destiny is to help you. So, they will follow you, and they will be a party member. Um, you don't get to control their actions, they will just attack automatically. They rave you dead, okay. Um, and... Yeah, so, and there are only five of them, so if they die, you can go back and get another one, but once you've used the fifth one, you can't get any more, and they can't go outside magic camp. I think I said that. Okay, Ravy dead, teddy bear backwards. If it's in the middle, you shouldn't worry, but if he's on the left like he is, you might want to worry, because he can call for a sky Yudet, and sky Yudets can, they have a one-hit KO move, so you're going to want to watch out for that. So yeah, but I was able to take him out pretty easily thanks to the flying man. Oh, and I'm gonna say guys, I'm leaving magic hands right now, but definitely grind for like five levels and get all the equips before you leave. But I'm just, I'm just saving time by not doing that now. But by the start of the next video, I'll have all the levels and equips. Okay, so we have the combination of Dad's Eyes Watcher and Mom's Eyes. This is a pretty common trio. 
Um, I would take out the mom's eyes first, then dad's eyes, then washer, because mom's eyes can do a continuous attack. Um, basically, they attack twice, which, you know, continuous. And also, there are enemies um, in the zoo called tigers. They can do a ten continuous attacks, but we didn't see any. Oh, geez, the flying man's taking a beating. And he died. Okay, that's not good. That is not good at all. That's very bad. At least we have the boomerang, which is a huge step up in attack power. And they're attacking the flying man. And I am over 15 and a half minutes, so I need to wrap this up soon. Uh, hurry up, dude. Uh, come on. Okay, you and me, Watcher. Oh, I hate these battles. They take so long. But there we go. The Watcher's dead. Now, I, I have not shown you all the enemies in Magic Hand. I'm sure I will at some point. But, um, yeah, just to let you know, the, the enemies you're seeing aren't all of them. And basically, the path I took there was just right, left, left, right. Pretty simple. And a four eyes. I may be slightly stronger than a watcher, I don't know. They don't really have anything special about them. Okay, ooh, level 11, nice. Yes, blah, blah, blah. These level up screens take forever. Ugh. This game is really annoying sometimes. In all these random encounters, and all the grinding you have to do. And, oh, Rich, that music scared me. Okay, this is a pretty uncommon enemy, and they ain't no PSI. And that did not do as much as I thought it would. And a smash attack. Okay. Uh, I am gonna eat a hammer. Nice. Hey, Nintendo learned a new PSI power. Let's check what it is quickly. Um, fourth D slip. Basically, for the cost of 13 PP, you can get out of any battle. And, okay, here we go. This is where I want to stop. Anyway, I am a Jurors Mass Mailman. I hope you guys enjoyed this part where we trekked through Magicant. But, uh, be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. And remember, definitely do some grinding and get those equips, because you're gonna need it.